For centuries, humanity has gazed up at the night sky, confident we understood its vastness. We charted stars, mapped galaxies, and even dared to estimate the number of worlds beyond our reach. Yet, each time we thought we had grasped the scale of the universe, reality proved us wrong. Now, the James Webb Space Telescope has delivered a revelation so staggering that it forces scientists to reconsider everything we thought we knew. With a single image, stretching across 13.5 billion years of cosmic history, Webb has revealed a universe far larger, far more complex, and far more populated than any theory dared to predict. This is not just a discovery, it is a redefinition of humanity's place in the cosmos. Before Webb, the Hubble Space Telescope had offered a glimpse into the universe's depths with its ultra-deep field. In a single patch of sky observed over days, Hubble revealed roughly 10,000 galaxies, each not a single star, but an entire island universe filled with billions of stars. That revelation expanded our understanding of existence, suggesting the observable universe might contain up to 2 trillion galaxies. For years, Hubble's vision defined our perception of cosmic scale. But Hubble had its limits. It was blind to the universe's oldest light, stretched over billions of years into the infrared spectrum. What Hubble could not see, Webb was designed to uncover. And when Webb's golden mirror finally opened its eye, the truth shattered every comfortable assumption. If Hubble offered a glimpse of a city block, Webb revealed an entire continent. One of Webb's largest observing programs, known as Cosmos Webb, dedicated over 250 hours to scanning a patch of sky three times the area of the full moon. Thousands of exposures were stitched together to create the most detailed cosmic map ever made. Within this single image lie an astounding 780,000 galaxies, structures stretching nearly to the dawn of time. In one frame, the story of cosmic evolution unfolds. Mature galaxies resembling our own alongside infant galaxies forming just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. The scale is almost incomprehensible. Imagine printing Hubble's deep field on paper. At that scale, Webb's map would cover a mural over 13 feet wide. Each speck of light represents a galaxy. Each galaxy, a universe unto itself. It is not merely data. It is a profound shift in perspective, a recontextualization of our existence against the vast canvas of creation. Perhaps the most unsettling revelation lies not in the sheer number of galaxies, but in their unexpected maturity. Conventional models suggested that galaxies forming a few hundred million years after the Big Bang should have been small, faint, and chaotic. Instead, Webb uncovered luminous, structured systems some with defined spiral arms and heavy elements like carbon and nitrogen, evidence that entire generations of stars had already lived and died in record time. These galaxies should not exist yet, and their presence challenges every assumption about cosmic evolution. Star formation, black hole growth, and galaxy assembly must have begun earlier, faster, and through processes still beyond our understanding. In a single sweep of its mirror, Webb has upended the story of the universe's creation, leaving us with a cosmos that is simultaneously familiar and alien. What Webb offers is not just images, but a challenge. Each galaxy, each cluster, each filament of cosmic structure hints that the universe may be immeasurable, perhaps even infinite. The vast web of galaxies stretches across billions of light years, so immense that even light takes eons to traverse them. And yet, here they are, captured in a single frame. For the first time, humanity has touched infinity, not metaphorically, but visually, scientifically. And this is only the beginning. The data collected in Webb's first year alone will keep astronomers busy for decades, perhaps generations. The telescope's findings do more than expand the universe. They suggest that its limits may forever remain beyond our grasp. As researchers studied Webb's Cosmos Webb field, they noticed something more unsettling. Galaxies were not scattered randomly. They aligned along invisible threads, 
forming colossal patterns known as the cosmic web. Filaments of dark matter and gas connect galaxies across unimaginable distances, some stretching billions of light years. Yet even more baffling, these structures appear too uniform and interconnected to have formed so quickly after the Big Bang. According to classical models, gravity would have required far more time to sculpt such order from chaos. Webb's observations suggest that organization was present almost from the beginning, a hidden blueprint written into reality itself. The universe may not be a chaotic explosion, it may be a masterpiece with rules we have yet to decipher. The implications ripple through the scientific community like shockwaves. For decades, the Big Bang has served as the foundation of cosmology, explaining the universe's birth and expansion. But Webb's data challenges core assumptions. Massive, mature galaxies existing so soon after the beginning imply either that the universe formed far faster than we thought or that our timeline is fundamentally flawed. Some scientists now consider alternative models, a cyclic universe reborn repeatedly, or time itself as layered rather than linear, allowing structures to appear sooner than our understanding of cause and effect would permit. What was once scientific certainty now feels like shifting sand. Webb forces us to question not only when the universe began but whether our concept of a beginning is valid at all. The deeper Webb peers, the more it points to a universe without edges. In Hubble's era, the observable universe, a sphere 93 billion light years across, was defined by the distance light could travel. Webb suggests that this is only a fraction of a far grander reality. If galaxies appeared fully formed so soon, the universe could be older than we imagined, or even eternal, stretching infinitely in time. Infinity, once a philosophical abstraction, now confronts science itself. The cosmos may be endless, and within that infinite canvas, every possibility might exist somewhere, encoded into the fabric of creation. Standing before Webb's images, we feel a paradox. Humanity is simultaneously infinitesimal and extraordinary. On one hand, the scale is humbling, hundreds of thousands of galaxies in a single frame, trillions beyond our reach, each with billions of stars. Against this immensity, we are a flicker, a breath in the dark. Yet, it is humanity that built Webb, humanity that asked the questions, humanity that glimpses the infinite. That we, a fragile species clinging to a small blue planet, can measure infinity is itself miraculous. Webb reflects not just the universe, but us, our curiosity, ingenuity, and determination. The James Webb Space Telescope was built to push the boundaries of vision, but its discoveries reach beyond sight. With each image, it reveals galaxies too ancient to fit our models, structures too vast to comprehend, and a scale so overwhelming it dissolves certainty. The universe is not merely large. It is layered, infinite, and perhaps eternal. For every answer Webb provides, a dozen questions emerge, stretching imagination to its limits. Yet within that enormity, humanity remains. Small, fragile, and fleeting, but capable of perceiving, understanding, and marveling at the cosmos itself. Webb's revelations are just the beginning. The universe may be greater than we imagined, perhaps beyond what we can imagine. And if you want to witness every hidden image, every staggering discovery, and every secret the cosmos reveals, follow the journey closely, because each revelation from Webb has the power not just to expand the universe in our minds, but to redefine reality itself.